20-year mortgage becoming a reality in a way to try to get more people into a home. WPTV News Channel 5's Matt Sesney today looked into what every new buyer needs to know. So in steps the FHA, the Federal Housing Administration, to green light 40-year mortgages. The payments are lower. People, yeah. More people can get into a mortgage. She's right. And Sinceri Gonzalez, a realtor in the hot Port St. Lucie housing market, agrees. 40-year mortgage stretches out that mortgage over a longer period of time, so it makes for a lower payment, which is what a lot of buyers need right now. Bankrate.com broke down the numbers on a $312,000 mortgage. The monthly payment for the 40-year loan was $100 less than the 30-year loan. But those extra years also added about 170 grand more in interest. But that's decades. Hi, family. Welcome back to another episode of Journey to Harmony. I'm your host, Richard Harmon. And today I wanted to come to talk to you about a recent release from the Federal Housing Administration, FHA, and uh, HUD. Um, they have announced that they are including a 40-year loan modification for existing mortgages. So this was released about a week ago now. And this is expected to go into effect beginning May of 2023. So we all know that housing prices have come, um, have risen astronomically. Uh, many people have been priced out when you include the price of the home and add it to that, the cost of the, the mortgage rate. So to help to, 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 to bridge that issue, um, they've extended the ter loan term from, um, from 30 years to 40 years. So this will help to reduce the price. Um, additionally, this will uh, get people who might not be able to qualify right now into a home. Um, but there's a lot of downsides to this as well. So the first thing is the, um, the banks are going to rake in a lot of money. So they're expected to bring in extra $170,000 um, per loan on this particular option. So as you can think about it, with all of these things that are happening right now with Credit Suisse and um, Silicon Valley Bank, um, the banks are going to need options in order to be able to repay some of these loans that are loaning out. So this 40-year mortgage going into place is a great option for collecting cash. We are in a higher inflation environment. This gives the the, um, the government a chance to correct, collect higher amounts back um, from these particular payments. But also, you know, it's it's something that will have a inverse effect in terms of pricing. So someone who could only afford a $300,000 home with a 30 year mortgage now could, you know, it's, uh, afford a much higher home with a 40 year mortgage. We saw this a lot during the pandemic with um, car loans that went from five years to seven years, to some eight years. So in the same way as what is this officially is being released, while initially it's only for people who are owning homes, eventually it will be released for people who are uh, home buyers as well. This will give added funds and added cash to those who are on the sidelines. So if you're here right now and you haven't yet purchased, if you own a home and you are thinking about selling, this this likely is going to bring even more um, funds to the market with the opportunity for uh, prices to be raised. It's unfortunate. Um, we still don't, there are a lot of reports around the country that there aren't a lot of inventory right now. Um, but please, you know, what I mean, like uh, if you have any updates on that, what you're seeing in your own market, please comment below. Let me know what you think. But please like, share and subscribe and uh, continue to comment. Thank you so much for joining Richard Harmon. Have a good day.